Brooklyn Independent Television. The smells coming from this bakery are so intoxicating, it begs you to step through the door. It said they make the best rye and pumpernickel breads ever. It's so good, people have been known to mail their breads to highly particular family members in other cities. And it's not just the breads. They make rolls, cakes, pastries, and it's all delicious. So, if your timing is just right, your order will be fresh out the oven. I gotta go, I can't resist anymore. Emilia Pokfalovs Gallego and I'm the owner of Serena Bakery. Serena Bakery is famous for the grain breads, the different babkas, especially cheese babka, the makovits, the papi seed strudel, ponchki of course, cheesecakes and apple cake. We try to bake the products that are baked in Poland and I guess we come very close to what the people in Poland ate. The quality is very good and I think that uh, it's always fresh here. And the selection of products, it's, it's pretty wide, so my kids love it. I buy this whole wheat bread, which I like very much, and uh, I always buy ponczki, you know, the donuts. I am Tomasz Kowalczyk. I'm working here in Serena Baker as a baker. Today we're going to make uh, Polish donuts, which we call the ponczkis. Um, First thing we have to do, uh, we, we, we have to mix uh, warm milk. Then I'm going to add the fresh cheese and the flour. Everything is in a bowl. I have to mix it for about three minutes. Now the ponchki dough is ready, so we're going to cut it for pieces and uh, roll it over. Now I'm going to go and get this parted. Now I'm putting this into the machine. I'm going to roll it over. And it's going to grow for uh, about 30 minutes. And uh, the skin is uh, a little bit dry, they're ready to fly. We're going to fry them on uh, 180 uh, degrees of Celsius for uh, about three minutes each side. First side when we fry the first side, we have to cover up the, the, the fryers so that there will be uh, rice a little bit more. After the first side it's ready, we have to open the cover, take the machine up and we have a cover for the other side and now we have to fry for the next three minutes. I'm going to fill up the ponchki with the fillings. Uh, today we have uh, two kinds of filling. Uh, one is uh, plum, the other one is mixed fruit. When the ponchki is ready, we will have to dust with the, with the powdered sugar. And they're ready to sell. I am from Kolbuszowa Dolna. That's the southern part of Poland. I came to United States in 1962. My father was a bakery in US and he spoiled us with a fresh, good bread, always. So when my father retired, with his help and our good friend Adam Jastrzemski and myself, we decided to open up a bakery. In 1991, soon after, the demand for our breads made us look for a larger location. Now we're going to, to make a party seed dough. Uh, we have the dough ready, it's, it's uh, red, rice perfectly, so now we're going to make a um, uh, seed, uh, seed filling. We're going to add some eggs, sugar, honey, butter, and walnuts. And on the end, we're going to add breadcrumbs. We have to mix it uh, uh, for about 5-10 uh, minutes. Now I'm going to cut the, the dough for, for puppy seed strudel. Now I'm going to roll, roll over the, the dough. 
Now we're going to add the poppy seed filling. And now we're going to roll it over as we're going to cut the little holes so we can see the poppy seeds, we can see what's inside. Here we have to brush them uh, with, the, with the eggs and uh, put to the oven for uh, an hour. Our poppy seed strudels are ready, so they have a nice, nice uh, gold color, how they're supposed to be. For our products we geared toward uh, Eastern European ethnic groups, but we found that everybody else likes it too. And really was close to home. When we came to this country, we came here to Greenpoint. Uh, Serena Bakery, actually, this, it was in my neighborhood. I used to live here so many years. Uh, right now I am in a different neighborhood in Douglaston. However, I love to shop here. And as you see, every time I'm coming, uh, it's either for the bread, it's either for the cake. I was born in Poland and raised on those products, so we love it. I believe we're going to continue uh, to be here and uh, we try to uh, uh, add different products to our line so we can please everyone, even though the neighborhood might change. Become a fan on Facebook, like Brooklyn Independent Television.